Yeah, I'll be taking requests from just now. Call the babies here, let her know that, uh, or him know that we're playing till uh, 10 o'clock tonight. I know some people are expecting maybe quarter of, 10 of, 10, but it's such a goddamn cheap show to get into. But uh, we're going to go all the way till 10. We're going to give you your, your money's worth tonight. And, uh, I always like to know when I go to a show, how long is this going to last? It's me, but the moment I get in the club, I sit down and like, oh, when is it over? It's got nothing to do with the act necessarily, it's just my nervousness, but uh, well, I'll tell you, they feed you pretty well over here at the Beachland too, because uh, they fed us two uh, plant-based uh, burgers, and uh, I've never felt so, I, I'm not going to eat again until like tomorrow morning or something. <laughs> Like stuck right now. Are you like really like uh, bloated at this point? Yes. Yes. <laughs> I feel you like stuff yourself right before facing a nice bunch of people like you guys. But uh, I'm gonna pass through. I know it. Let's. Uh, let's uh, I want to do you one of those. Uh, I wrote two tunes during that pandemic, and uh, I'd like to do you one of them now. Like I, I, like I said before, I'm not bragging on these tunes. I always had expectations super high. This is like, it's not a best song in the world, but it's like, it's a true song. That's got something going for it right there. You know? Not all songs are true, but I think this one, it's not necessarily a happy song, but it's a, it's not an optimistic song, but it's kind of a true song. And um, it's also a, I think this is the first sing-along that I've ever, it's a sing-along. And uh, so that means that, you know, it's got kind of a catchy chorus, and I know you don't know it, but being a sing-along, like every line in the chorus has a rest of equal length before it so that I can say the words and then just sing, you know, that always happens on a sing-along. Plus, it's just so fucking well written, you're just going to know it. By the <laughs> It's really, really good, okay. And I guess, I guess. My son said this is true. My son's in a band, and this is about bands. It's called Bands, and my son's in a band. And uh, and he's doing great. Like, uh, he joined this band, like, what is it now? It's August? He joined this band a year ago. And they're doing great. They played at the Ryman Auditorium. They played at Coachella Festival out in California. And they, they've been... Uh, on tour with Weezer for the last uh, month or two, playing these big sheds, you know. And uh, so, anyway, I'm kind of bragging on him because I'm proud of him. He's like 26 and he's uh, living his dream. But anyway, I ran this tune past him. He said it was true. So here we go. Bands, we've all been in them. They drive around in vans and they sleep on the floor. Their lives are boring, like they're recording. So let's not talk about your band anymore. Let's not talk about the record business or the way your drummer used to drink. About your young years. I don't share your interest. I just hired you to fix the sink. Bands, we've all been in them. They drive around in bands and they sleep on the floor. Their lives are pouring like they're recording. So let's not talk about your band anymore, Marsha. <laughs> it's almost too good for the song. <laughs> You were the darlings of the English press. Who cares? Your <laughs> base was biggest in the Midwest. 
who cares? My uncle served in both the Iraq wars. His stories are tiresome, but they're twice as good as his. So let's focus, if we can, on the plumbing. Cause plumbing is a boon to humankind. But five years of cheap motels and drunken drumming That's just an everyday mistake to leave behind Sing with me Bands, we've all been in Clap around and dance Sleep on the floor Stay with me, their lives are boring Their recordings Like their recordings so let's not talk about your band anymore. Now yodel. No, let's not talk about your band. 